China's Chengdu J-20 Mighty Dragon has crossed a historic milestone with over 300 stealth fighters now in PLA Air Force service, marking the largest fifth-generation fleet outside the United States and redefining the air power balance across the Indo-Pacific. In the shifting landscape of Asia-Pacific security, the Chengdu J-20 Mighty Dragon stands as the centerpiece of China's aerial transformation. Once envisioned as a deterrent against U.S. and allied stealth aircraft, it has now matured into the world's largest non-Western fifth-generation fighter fleet. Recent assessments confirm that by October 2025, more than 300 J-20s have rolled off Chengdu Aerospace Corporation's assembly lines, with the majority already integrated into active PLA Air Force service across multiple commands. This remarkable milestone not only marks the triumph of Chinese aerospace engineering but also signals a decisive moment in the global contest for air superiority. The J-20's origins date back to the late 1990s under the JXX program, a classified initiative to counter advanced fighters such as the US F-22 Raptor and F-35 Lightning II. Developed by Chengdu Aerospace Corporation CAC, the prototype first flew in January 2011, heralding China's arrival in the elite club of stealth fighter nations. Low-rate initial production began in 2015, with full-scale deliveries starting in 2016 and initial operational capability achieved in 2017. By 2018, the aircraft reached full combat readiness, transitioning from experimental prototype to a frontline war machine. A pivotal turning point came in 2019 when the J-20 replaced its Russian-made AL-31F engines with domestically manufactured WS-10 series power plants, enabling sustained mass production free from foreign dependency. By 2022, Chengdu Aerospace Corporation had optimized its assembly process using pulseline production technology, dramatically increasing throughput. Independent evaluations now confirm that by late 2025, over 300 J-20s have been manufactured, including prototypes, test airframes, and operational variants. This milestone was celebrated publicly at the Changchun Air Show 2025, where the 300th J-20 was displayed a symbolic marker of China's leap toward fifth-generation mass production. Between mid-2024 and late 2025 alone, more than 50 aircraft were delivered, underscoring the scale and speed of Beijing's industrial expansion. Current estimates indicate annual output between 70 and 100 units, with some projections suggesting production could reach 200 per year through facility expansion and streamlined logistics. If the present tempo continues, China's J-20 inventory may exceed 500 units by 2026 and approach 1,000 by 2030 potentially surpassing the combined numbers of F-22s and F-35As in U.S. Air Force service. The sheer pace of J-20 production highlights the industrial discipline and resource allocation underpinning China's defense manufacturing ecosystem, where digitalized factories and AI-assisted quality control ensure consistent output. Moreover, the J-20 program has become a benchmark for integration across China's state-owned aerospace network, linking entities such as AVIC, AECC and CETC in a synchronized supply chain unprecedented in scale. Chinese analysts argue that this milestone demonstrates the nation's capacity to sustain prolonged fifth-generation production without foreign dependency, a feat previously monopolized by Western powers. Above all, surpassing 300 units has elevated the J-20 from a symbol of technological aspiration to a mass-produced instrument of strategic deterrence, redefining the boundaries of air power in the Indo-Pacific. While early models relied on the WS-10C, capable of producing around 147 knots of thrust, China has been integrating the next-generation WS-15, delivering up to 180 knots with full three-axis vectoring control. The WS-15 promises not only superior thrust-to-weight ratios but also sustains supercruise capability above Mach 1.5, aligning performance closer to Western stealth platforms. Since 2022, the PLA Air Force has begun fielding WS-15-equipped J-20B and J-20S variants in limited numbers, marking a major leap in indigenous propulsion technology despite ongoing Western export control pressures. The introduction of the J-20S twin-seat variant enhances command and control functions and serves as a network node for drone coordination, data fusion, and battlefield management. The aircraft's digital cockpit and AI-assisted systems allow pilots to manage complex engagements while maintaining situational awareness across multiple domains. 
By pairing the J-20 with UAVs and long-range sensor platforms, China aims to build a distributed, resilient air combat network designed to counter Western technological advantages. China's fifth-generation arsenal matures, at the heart of the J-20's lethality lies its fusion of stealth geometry and advanced sensor architecture. Inside the cockpit, an integrated sensor fusion suite allows the pilot to visualize the battle space in real time, fusing radar, IR, and data link inputs into a single tactical picture. Internally, the J-20 houses four PL-15 or PL-21 Beyond Visual Range missiles, giving it a standoff reach of over 200 kilometers. For strike roles, it can carry precision-guided bombs or anti-ship munitions in its internal bay, maintaining stealth profiles. The combination of stealth, supercruise, and long-range weapons enables the J-20 to perform first day of war penetration missions in command and control roles in contested airspace. The 300-unit milestone in the future of the Mighty Dragon. Crossing the 300 aircraft mark in less than a decade of service is an extraordinary industrial feat that cements China's status as a global aerospace power. From its first prototype flight in 2011 to its current multi-brigade deployment, the J-20 has transformed from an ambitious experiment into a strategic reality a fleet that symbolizes China's determination to challenge Western air dominance. As production accelerates beyond 300 units and approaches the 500 mark, the Mighty Dragon will remain the cornerstone of Beijing's air deterrence strategy for the next decade. In the long term, the J-20 program's success could redefine global perceptions of defense industrial parity between East and West. Its steady rise reveals that China's aerospace sector is now capable of sustained innovation cycles, integrating iterative upgrades every few years of practice once exclusive to NATO powers. The continued rollout of twin seat J-20S variants, enhanced WS-15 engines, and AI-enabled mission software will ensure the platform remains operationally relevant well into the 2040s. The Mighty Dragon now stands as a symbol of China's technological maturity and strategic resolve in the face of global scrutiny. As the Indo-Pacific enters a new era of aerial competition, the J-20's expanding presence ensures that Beijing's voice in the strategic dialogue of the skies will be both visible and unavoidable.